Greetings and salutations, folks. I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here, one trailer at a time. Today, we're going to take a look at a 2023 Jayco J Flight, model number 331 BTS, formerly 33R BTS, weighs around 9,000 pounds or so, three slides, two bedrooms, an island kitchen with an outside kitchen. And I'm here with my boy, that Dutch bad boy, Brendan Hannemeyer on the camera today. Say hello, Brendan. What's going on, happy campers, future campers, and fellow salespeople? Thank you so much for tuning in to the number one RV YouTube channel in the world. Please smash and click those like and subscribe buttons. We're also on Instagram, TikTok, and on Facebook, producing some sweet reels on there, so you should check that out as well. I love J Flights. Great trailers. You're going to enjoy this. It's quite easy to see how you got the nickname Dutch Bad Boy Brennan rolling around town with your hat backwards like that, like some hoodlum. It's what it is. Straight up fiasco, <laughs> front power jack, 20 pump or paint tanks. It's gonna come with a uh, battery in a box from Lazy Acres. We got four stabilizer jacks on this guy. They're manual, they're by rock solid. Bring them down with a drill, bingo bango. Good looking front skin on this, aluminum skin down the side. Wood framing, pass through storage, going all the way through there to the other side. Right there you've got your sewer drain. Rack and pinion style slides on this side, Brendan. Rack and pinion this side. <laughs> 15 inch Goodyear tires, and then it's got a Schwintech style slide on the kitchen side on the other side. Of Schwintech, there. Wintech. There we go, baby. <laughs> 50 empty tactical style cord. At least you find yourself funny. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what was I saying? Got a spare tire here that we're going to put a beautiful Lazy Acre tire cover. Yeah, thank you, brother. <laughs> roof ladder. Get up on your roof, check your seals every 90 days. Fresh water fill, city water connection, outside shower. There's a bracket right through here to receive a outside griddle that's going to match up really nicely with our outside kitchen a couple drawers in our outside kitchen a sink that's plumbed in three cubic foot electric fridge cupboard there light here ah light there receptacle furnace vent and our electric awning starts right here goes all the way forward covers our kitchen swing textile slide fridge vent fridge vent range hood vent three-step entrance up and in and then just the other side over here of our pass through storage. Our awning ends here. We have outside TV location. Gas, on demand, water heater. Let's see what kind of travel access we got for this guy. It's not gonna be much. <clears throat> so we can't quite get into the kitchen or the, fr or the fridge and we can't get to the washroom, but we can park our butts down on the couch. That's something. Let's get this thing opened up. Right on folks, we're inside that 331 BTS. Nice kitchen in here. Really nice island kitchen, seamless countertops, under mount plastic sink. I'm a big fan of this hutch action here at the back too. Receptacle and USBs, good covered space there. Definitely a good spot, spot where you can park your appliances. We got some shelves in that closet, or that uh, cover there, right? Love now, to see it. Love to see it. Pantry space in through here. Six. 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 Six cubic foot gas electric fridge. That's an option on this one. Skinny cupboard here. Microwave range hood, glass stove top cover, blue lights on the oven knobs, cupboard there, and cupboard here. Yeah, the island's nice. In the island, we have two cutlery drawers too. Cupboard space here for garbage can recycling. <clears throat> and then one of my big things on this model is as you walk in, you've got this closet. And you got a spot there to kick off your shoes, slide switches, controls for lights and stuff like that, bonus cover there. And then our TV's across from our couch. There we go. Another shelf. You loving those shelves, eh? Look at that. TV on arm. More cupboards with more shelves. Tell your Dutch friends, Brendan. Yeah. We got our pull-out style trifold sofa in through here. It's gonna come out. You can sleep two people will fit here if they're in love. We got some cup holders, booth dinette, cupboard space there. Put that booth down, turn it into a bed. Windows out in the slide, and then let's head back here, Brendan, into the bunk room. We've got a slide here. What style slide, Brendan? Rack and pinion, baby. That's it, cupboard space there. The booth goes into a bed. This is gonna pop down, turn into another bed. Big, big fan of windows in the bunks. Window there, bunk, bunk. Look at all the storage back here, B. 
space there for a TV. Cupboard there. Two more drawers here down below. And then a nice closet here. How do you feel about this handle? Oh, that strongly. handle. Yeah, strongly? I feel great about it. Looks like it'll catapult me up on the <laughs> top one. That's it. All right, coming through the living space. We got ourselves a pretty nice washroom, actually. Plastic toilet, good hip space, good leg space. The dump truck fits. Double cupboards here. Sink, no medicine cabinet. Hiding here is good. Radius style shower doors. Boom, boom. Coming through, or coming out of the washroom into the bedroom. We've got our queen size bed. Let's give me a 60 by 74. We've got hanging on the one side, shelving on the other, open storage. We have a second AC as an option on this guy, and the solar kit as an option as well. Did you make the bed, Brennan? Yes, almost. Yes. <laughs> Three for four corners is not bad. Storage underneath the bed, too. That's the video, folks. Hit the like button, the subscribe button. Hit us up on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Leave us a comment down below, and have yourself a good day.